guys, what is up? It is Luke here. Um, I wasn't exactly sure about doing this video to begin with, but because I've seen quite a few people do GCSE results opening videos, I decided, you know what, I'm going to share with you guys what the grades I got for my GCSE mocks, okay? So, just bear this in, like, this in mind. This is not the only mock of... Um, mocks we have or that we have done to those of you to anyone who may watch me from watch my videos from like other countries in the world who don't do who don't do GCSEs when they get to like 10th 11th grade or whatever it may be um, we have these things called GCSEs um, and I'm j again guys I'm just explaining for anyone who doesn't who isn't a UK resident um, we have these GCSE exams, but we've also got these mocks as a means to prepare us for what the actual GCSEs are going to be like. And um, I do actually have my results for the December mock results, just making that very clear, in my hand right now. And I know that they were given out close to a month ago at this point, just under a month ago. But um, yeah, I thought, you know what, as a precursor to what my GCSE exam results video, like for the summer, when that comes around and what that's going to be like, I decided, you know what, might as well do this as a little precursor. <laughs> uh, this is not going to be good. Right, okay, so here we go. So I'm going to go in order of how they are listed. Right, okay. So to start off with, for drama, um, you are judged on both exam paper and individual component grades for across all of these things that you see and um, just bear that in mind so in drama my target grade is a four so that's a high d low c and um i got a two in the exam but a three in the controlled assessment and the um my overall grade i got given was a two yeah that's not very good is it um for english language my target is a four and i actually managed to get a four um, for English literature, my target's a four, and I managed to get a four. Um, yeah, so that uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I, I know I could have done better than that. For geography, my target's a three, and I got a three. Um, for maths, my target's a four, and I got a one. <laughs> oh no. For P for P E R, which is philosophy, ethics, and religion, for anyone who doesn't know, uh, or is curious, um, my target grade was a three, but I got a two, though apparently I wasn't that far off of getting a three. Um, for combined science, um, it said the overall grade was a three and a th no, um, my, the target grade I was supposed to get was like it said it says fifty five on the paper, but it's like it's supposed to be a five and a five, so two fives. And I got two threes. And I do combined science, just so you know. Not um, higher tier of triple science. I don't do that. Um, and um, But there is one subject that doesn't get any mention on here at all. And that is the creative media. Um, the BTEC creative media mock that I did. Um, but what I will say on that is I got, I think it was 31 out of 50 on that, which is a level 2 pass, and my target for that subject is a level 2 pass. So yeah, I got that, and I'm happy with that. But I mean, yeah, th these mock results, yeah, yeah, just, just, yeah, no, no, not, uh, no, I, I don't think that, that that's very, that's not good, that's not good, that's terrible, that is absolutely pitiful. <laughs> Oh, and we've also got another lot of mocks next month. So we'll probably get results for those, and I wonder what those are going to be like. For me, they probably won't be much better than this, to be fair. Um, but anyway, guys, that's it for my video <laughs> explaining to you guys my pitiful um, 27, 2017's um, December mock results. Yeah, not happy with this at all. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video just to see me having got pitifully low grades on here. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you with the next video, whatever that may be. So until then, goodbye, and you've been warned.